Oh my gosh, hello! Welcome back! Another week in my life, another weekly vlog. What's poppin'? So, um, happy Monday. It's Monday. So I am currently just doing my makeup and I have a new highlighter palette so I thought we could play with it together. Um, I showed you guys in the last vlog I got some things from ColourPop which I purchased because I needed another flexitarian like the most magical highlighter in all of the land if you like always want that really intense highlight that you see on like Instagram but you just can't find it it's it's this like trust flexitarian by Colourpop I'll show you it's no joke like it's kind of like wet feeling like it's just crazy like you'll never be able to top this like it's like painting light on your face so if you've always wondered how to get that really intense that's like one little swipe too like you can layer it on um, and I always get questions like what is your inner corner highlight my inner corner highlight is always crazy it's always this it's always this it makes them like glow so anyway I had shown you guys last week that I got some new things from ColourPop. Uh, I needed this and then I was on their site and I'm like, okay. So I, I'm wearing this on my eyes today. It's the You Had Me At Hello eyeshadow palette. So I am wearing this in the crease, this on the lid, this on the brow bone, this in the crease, and then I put a little bit of this on my lash line, like a faux eyeliner. And I'm only wearing mascara, so I think it actually really helped because it's kind of making my lashes look a little bit more full by putting that dark brown on the lash line. If you want me to do a tutorial on this, let me know um, if it's, like, worthy of a tutorial. Um, but I think it's really pretty, and it's kind of, like, purpley and taupey and soft and, like, easy to do. And I put white on my waterline. And then I'm wearing the ColourPop Zuma ultra blotted lip on my lips and I love the formula it's like a thinner liquid matte lipstick so anyway um, I want to try out I haven't highlighted yet as you can see I'm not glowing I got one of their highlighter palettes it's the gimme more pressed powder palette from ColourPop so I wanted to try it out see if it's any good um, it's really gorgeous though I really like the colors. Okay, I'm going to do a little dipping in these first two colors. Ooh. Yes. Mm-hmm. Oh, color pop. You never disappoint. So, anywho, my office is a hot mess since I got back from Florida. <sighs> So many packages that I need to organize. I have a video I need to film like right now. Look at how long my hair actually got since I took my extensions out. I do miss my extensions though. Like having that long hair was so fun. But I'm growing my hair out though. But it's not bad. It's not bad. So I took a shower. I'm going to need to dry the rest of my hair. Um, film that video. My mom has a dentist appointment out near me. Oh, I forgot to show you guys. I had told you I ordered one of the... Uh, Kim Kardashian KKW fragrances for Valentine's Day. I really love the packaging. I just think it's so pretty. And it, this one actually smells really good. I could not decide between this and the blue one. Um, but I really like how it smells. And the packaging is so cute. And it's got like a little slant. So like it sits up when it's laying down. So anyway, and it's kind of cute on display. So all right, <sighs> gotta get to work. All right, guys, just checking in. Wow. <laughs> I have been very productive today, so I am, it's like 3.30, and this is kind of like the first moment I've just like taken a second, so laundry, still going, um, filmed, edited, probably gonna film another video, just come in the spirit, uh, did my hair, also took a shower, and I'm going through, when I'm away on vacation, I come home to quite a lot of packages uh, and I know I'm like super fortunate and this job never gets old and I never stop feeling like so thankful to get all this 
free makeup and beauty stuff, which is why I like to share it with you guys too though, um, by doing like giveaways. I'm doing a giveaway on my Instagram right now, but I'm gonna do another one soon too because I've accumulated a lot more stuff. As you guys saw in the last vlog, I got a massive amount from Revlon. Revlon. Um, so I also just got some more, so I thought I would just do a quick little haul. And some of this is actually really great because oh, this is my Walmart shirt for my Walmart video. I actually love it. I did a little tie knot. So, um, <laughs> what was I saying? I can never remember. Um, some of this is going to be really, really good um, when I start Accutane. I haven't started Accutane yet. Uh, I announced it in two vlogs ago, two weekly vlogs ago. Uh, so I'm starting it not until March because I have to, I had to like wait a month um, because there's so many like rules about like birth control and your blood and all this stuff. It's very intense, but I am gonna be doing monthly updates on that, making like separate videos. I literally binged on Carly Humbert's videos the other day. I've been following her for like years. <laughs> um, I really like her content uh, and she had gone on Accutane and I asked her about it and I watched all of her videos. So I ended up ordering like a bunch of products that she had recommended in those videos. So if you wanna see her Accutane journey, her name is Carly Humbert and I really like her. She does great makeup. Um, so anyway, there's a lot of like dry skin products in here and Carly had mentioned we're at a really bad angle right now I'm just gonna go with it double chins exist um, Carly had mentioned uh, That she did a lot of like vitamin C and brightening and stuff during her Accutane journey to lighten her scars as well so uh, I'm gonna be doing a lot of that because I have like just a lot a lot of scarring still and um I don't know, I just like, I'm really excited to start this journey. I know you guys have left me a lot of comments about your experiences or people you know's experiences. And I mean, I'd say it's probably 50-50 for positive and not so positive, but I appreciate you taking the time. And this is definitely still something that I'm very interested in trying. And I'm just gonna be very like hyper aware. And if I notice anything going wrong, I will stop. But I will be 100% honest with you guys, let you know how it's going in case you're curious or your friends are curious. But Anyway, I'll start like a full video every single month of like updates and how I'm feeling and how it's working and all that stuff um, because I asked you guys and you said you want me to document the journey. So let's do a little haul from Soap and Glory who I love so much. They sent me a little PR package. We have the shower butter and the creamy body wash, super hydrating, which is great um, because I think like the number one thing with Accutane is that I'm gonna get really, really, really painfully dry, which is weird for me because I'm so oily. So it's gonna be really weird to feel that way. Um, there's also this thing called Melty Talented Dry Skin Balm, which I think is kind of perfect as well um, for all like the dryness I'm gonna get on my hands. Then we have, this looks great as well. This is called the Bright and Pearly Radiance Boosting Cocktail. Uh, I think certain things are gonna be okay. Hello? <laughs> certain things are gonna be okay um, when my skin is really sensitive, but we'll give it all a try. Uh, so this is like radiance boosting. Oh, vitamin C, pomegranate, lumi luminospheres. I don't know, but all I know is I need to be brightened and my scars need to be brightened. They sent a bunch of bath bombs, which I can't use right now, but hopefully in the future, because I don't have a good bathtub. Um, but wherever I live next, probably will. Then we have a What Appealing Declog Mask. I'll probably use this before I go on Accutane, before my skin gets really sensitive. This is great for like oil, clogged pores, so I'll do that. Then I'm gonna save this for while I'm on Accutane, Miracle Moisture Mask. Uh, then we have a pore refining mask. I'll probably use that before. I'm kind of like trying to organize everything for like now and later. I have got a lot of skincare coming in the mail the next week for the Accutane journey. I have Aquaphor on deck. I like bought <laughs> multi-packs. I bought um, the Aquaphor lip, Aquaphor like cream. I bought everything because I know I'm gonna need it. Um, radiance boosting mask, I'll probably save that for during. And this is definitely gonna be for during because this is the under eye brightening hydro peel masks, uh, hydro gel masks, sorry. So this is for your eyes and Carly and other people have mentioned that you can get really, really, really dry and dehydrated under the eyes so it can just look very sunken and dark and dehydrated. So I'll save this for then. And that's it for Soap and Glory. Then we have one from The Balm. I love The Balm. 
Ooh, take home the bronze. That's so cute. Cute for award season. Let's see. I like how this says confidential. Oh, it's like you're announcing the movie winner. Or the, the movie winner, the award winner. And the winner is Alexandra. Oh, what a cute concept. I love me some good packaging. Um, oh my God, also, I know, I'm, I'm spoiled and I always feel kind of bad because I just, I never feel like I deserve all this. Like, it's just, it's just crazy. Um, but Urban Decay sent me the new Naked Petite Heat palette. You guys know how much I love the Naked Heat. Look at this little baby one. It's perfect for travel. It's like all warm matte shades. Like it's perfect for travel. I'm officially in love with that. So then we have this little kit from The Balm and I think it's all bronzing products, which sounds pretty exciting. What? Oh my God. <laughs> so we have a water resistant black mascara. We have a ton of bronzers i'll definitely be saving these for the giveaway um there's a lot of different shades wow anti-orange bronzer nice wow that's crazy look how cute they are that's a nice color i really love their packaging the balm has really really cute packaging um oh yay um mary luminizer one of my favorite favorite highlighters that i bought years ago and i'm still in love with to this day um black liquid liner and a meet matte hues my favorite formula of liquid lipstick well probably top five um really good formula in the color devoted it's like a really pretty fuchsia and that's it for this little haul i'm just trying to organize everything because when you come back from vacation and you have like a dozen packages you just want to organize so anyway laundry is going i this laundry i'm really lucky at my apartment now i have the washer and dryer in unit like i'm really really lucky to have that i've never heard of that happening i have to sneeze oh no Ugh. i hate that feeling when it's not going to come out Ugh. Um, but I'm really lucky and that one has like an air dry mode so like it won't shrink your clothes It takes forever, but like it's way quicker than just like leaving them out to dry. So Anyway, that's my story <laughs> I'll be quiet Good morning everybody. Happy Tuesday. So I just got to the gym. I just pulled in um, Haven't been to the gym in a hot minute, so I'm excited to get back into it Good for the old noggin Good for the endorphins um, and your body. So I'm gonna go work out. I have my AirPods in my pocket, I think. This is like the best Black Friday investment that I ever got. Like seriously, I am obsessed with the freaking AirPods. I say it all the time, but I love them. Like they're great for um, traveling. Like whipping these out on the plane was so magical and so simple and like bring them to the gym. And I love how easy they are to charge. Like you just charge the bottom. This is not promotional wish it was because they were a little expensive but i do think they were worth it though especially if you can find like a good deal on like black friday or something so um i just have on like a gray t-shirt and my striped nike plus leggings and my adidas sneakers so i'm gonna go work out and then i have to go home and do a little bit of work and something that's due today and then later i have to go get stuff for dinner and I feel like I had something else to do. Today's kind of, this is like just how it is. Like when you come back from vacation, it's just like catching up. I don't have a lot going on this week. Um, it's pretty much just getting my life back in order. So, uh, skin, my cheek has just been like breaking out so much lately. I don't know what's going on. I don't know, I'm frustrated, but anyway, I'm gonna go work out. Okay, so some time has passed. I am dressed, showered, makeup. Am I focused? I'm not sure. I'm um, just wearing leggings. My sneakers that I wear every day that I'm in love with are so comfy. Scarf from Aldo, Boohoo jacket, sweater from <laughs> Rue 21. So now I'm just gonna go and run some errands, go to Target, uh, the bank, and I think that's it. But then I gotta come home and do some work. So let's go to Target. This is so weird. This is the first time I've come to Target and they don't have Anything I'm looking for. They don't have any lash glue or my eye drops for contacts to like lubricate your eyes. 
because my contacts make my eyes so dry. That's so weird. Bummer, might have to go to CVS too. Yeah, it's not here. Okay. <laughs> okay, there's no Halo Top either, which is my go-to ice cream. So, I'm leaving with not much. <laughs> Guess I didn't need a cart. Um, so, this is all that I ended up getting, more hummus. I like to eat this with carrots, like every day I'm obsessed. Um, a giant thing of my Faye Greek yogurt, which I make like sauces with. I use it kind of in place of like sour cream. Cotton ovals, lean ground turkey, and then tonight I'm just gonna make some chicken breast for dinner, so. Oh, I'm kind of curious. Let's see if they have it here. Have you guys tried this? The pasta made from chickpeas? Let me know in the comments, because I'm kind of intrigued. I kind of want to try it. Um, yeah, I guess that's all I need. Kind of anticlimactic. Well, they were out of a lot of stuff, which is kind of weird. I don't know. Okay, I actually found the halo top in the front. Super excited. My favorite ice cream. Ooh, birthday cake. I love birthday cake. I haven't tried the peanut butter. I tried the dairy-free peanut butter. I didn't like it, but maybe the regular one is better. But these are so good. They don't have a lot of flavors. Ooh, this is one of my favorites. There's one left. The Cogito is actually really bomb. Hi, I'm back. And I finally, if you watched my vlog the other day, um, my weekly vlog, I discovered how to change the lighting adjustment for the vlog on this camera. I ha I'm... I'm still learning. I'm not gonna lie. When I started YouTube, I literally had no idea what I was doing. I kind of still feel like I don't know what I'm doing. Like, thank God I have a manager now who can teach me things. I don't know anything. Like, I really just don't, like, know. I, and it's nice to meet other, like, YouTubers and creators, too, because they have taught me a lot. Like, I don't know things. You just learn things from experience of life. Anyway, um, my room is currently a mess. My office is a mess. Um, I just filmed edited and uploaded, which I never do. I usually like pre-film for like the next day or two. I don't do it like far out, but um, I never really do it all in one day. But I was really excited. Like I filmed it and I was just really, really excited. So since I got back from Florida, I've just been like work, 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 because I'm just excited and I just missed filming. But um, I filmed a review. I'm wearing one of the tops now. How cute. Um, I, you guys know that Loft launched plus sizes, which was huge, um, and about time, uh, everywhere else needs to as well. Uh, it's so funny, like, these, uh, it's just weird, like, these brands are missing out on, like, millions of dollars, like, you're dumb, like, you're dumb. Um, <laughs> there's so, like, so many people are plus size, and so many of us are willing to give you our hard-earned money for awesome clothing, like, you're missing out. But anyway, I was really excited that, um, they dropped plus sizes, so I bought, like, um, a dress, jeans, shorts, a blouse, a top, um, a little bit of everything, so I put that review up. So if you haven't watched that yet, definitely watch it, because it was really fun to, like, try the clothing on and review it. Um, but, like, look how cute this top is, and I'm wearing these cute little high-waisted sailor shorts, which you can't even see, but it's fine. So anyway, I got to my boxy charm in the mail, so I wanted to open that with you guys. I don't do these as separate videos anymore, just because I don't feel like anyone, like, fully cares about it. <laughs> Uh, and like even since I stopped posting them people didn't really seem to like notice or care so I was like okay that's fine I can just put them in the vlog so I just love this color this mustardy yellow okay so we're gonna open BoxyCharm oh ho, ho. Galaxy Glow okay I already see the word holographic which makes me excited I really uh like how the holographic stuff works but I don't find myself wearing it normally um, is that weird? I also changed my lip. Sorry, I feel like I'm all over the place. Uh, but I hauled this. Uh, I don't think you've seen that yet. <laughs> I'm gonna be posting, like, a makeup haul video. If you haven't, it's coming soon. But I bought the KKW Beauty Lip Creams. So the one I'm wearing now, I can't remember if I talked about this. It's Kiki I'm wearing right now. It's really pretty, like, baby soft pink. But earlier, I had worn this gorgeous nude called Kimberly. And I just loved it. It was so perfect nude. And I really love the formula of these. If you're like a nude pink lip wearer, then I'd say that's worth the money. Um, because I really like the formula. It wears well. It's not like drying. The colors are beautiful. Um, but they're definitely on the lighter side. Lighter than I even typically wear. Okay, so. What is this? 
Sugar and Lemon Moisturizing Lip Buffer. Ooh, this is from Seraphine Botanicals. This goes for $24. Soft crystals, nourishing, buff your lips, avocado, whole oil, all the oils. <laughs> this is gonna be fun, a lip buffer. I love to exfoliate my lips because liquid lipsticks take a toll as we all know. So let's see. Ooh, so it looks like this just in a little tube. I'm guessing it's just like a lip scrub in here, which I'm excited about, especially lemon. I love lemon. If I can ever get this off. I love having my acrylic nails. I'll probably take them off soon because I go through phases and I just like my natural nails with like gel polish or the dip, but I go through such phases, but like when they're long, I was trying to get the little aluminum foil off of my, aluminum foil, like aluminum topping, whatever, off of my toner this morning. <laughs> couldn't get it off. Like I actually couldn't get it off and I had to like walk away. Oh, did anyone see that? I wonder if I, when I watch that back, I'll, I will get that after, but I just spilled some. Ooh, but it smells really good. It smells kind of like a lemon candy. Okay, so we'll try that out at some point. Then we have from Cover FX, we have the Shimmer Veil. I don't know what this is, but it costs $28. Shimmering creams, crease proof on the eyes, shimmer effect anywhere. Ooh, look at her. She's a beauty. Let me see. So these can go on like anywhere, but I think this is definitely an eye situation. This is gorgeous. It's not translating up there. Come down here. Look at that. So gorgeous. Um, all right, so that's beautiful. I will definitely be playing with that. And the fact that it says it's crease proof, I hope it is because anytime I put any sort of cream on my eyelid, um, even if I set it with powder, it always creases, so. From Naked Cosmetics, look at that. Holographic lovin'. This is that highlighter palette. This is $39.99. Ooh, I'm so excited. Ooh. Look at all the holographic colors. Let's see how they are. Ooh, they're actually really pretty. See, my issue is, like, they're gorgeous. Look. They're super pretty, but I'm, I just, I'm so traditional. Sorry, that you must probably feel sick after watching that. I'm like whipping you around. I never actually, I'm so traditional with like my highlighters and my makeup. Like I just don't, I can get fun with like eyeshadow colors or a dark fun lip, but I just, I don't ever reach for like a fun highlighter. I just like it to be like the classic pink or white or nude. Um, but I know one of my best friends will love that. So, uh, all right. Lastly, actually two more things. We have the Vintage by Jessica Liebs Liebenskind. I've seen this before, the name. Um, it's a smoky eye pencil in black. Always, they always give some kind of lip or eye pencil. And then we actually have a brush set here, which is three brushes. The eyeliner is $21 and these three brushes are $29.99. They're from Crown. And Crown has great brushes. So it looks like we have kind of just like a little bit of a tapered powder brush. Then we have more of a, I would say these are kind of like face brushes. This looks like a good concealer brush. And um, this is a smaller, more defined powder brush. I am all good on brushes, so I'll make sure I save that for our next like giveaway or something like that. Um, I'm afraid I'm gonna step on my sugar scrub that I dropped. Uh, but anyway, yeah, it's getting late now actually. It's like 4.30 and it's, I've noticed it's actually staying lighter out later now. It's like 6 or 6.30 it gets dark now, which is very nice compared to the 3.34. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna keep working. <laughs> I have another video I need to edit. Honestly, like these weekly vlogs are super fun, but sometimes I feel kind of bad like when I'm not doing anything exciting. But I do know you guys always say you like to just hang out. Oh, also, 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 this brush. I have so much to say all the time. I bought this brush in the makeup haul as well that you will see soon. It's the Real Techniques, I think it's just the Pro Face Brush, Expert Face Brush. And it's their number one selling brush. I put my foundation on with it today. I did not use my beauty blender at all. And that is crazy for me. Um, I use it to bake, but that's all. This works so well. It blends your foundation in flawlessly, any liquid or cream. Um, I highly recommend this brush. So that's probably gonna be my favorite for a while because I'm kind of weird about foundation brushes. I just love my beauty blender, but I really love that. 
So I have to clean up my office. There's a lot going on on the floor that you cannot see as well. So I'm also watching Ryland's new video. I love when everyone posts at the same time. I'm like, yes, <laughs> yes. I'm watching Ryland, Trisha, Jason. Um, well, those are the three that I saw posted in the last like hour or two. But anyway, that's all for now. I'm trying the lip scrub kind of spontaneously. And I was like, I should probably be vlogging. It smells so good. My lips are feeling really dry. They feel good though. So anyway, now I am currently just making dinner and hanging out, but I want to show you guys something crazy. My mom, um, I sent my mom, tomorrow is Valentine's, so I sent my mom um, a bouquet of roses <laughs> that she just got delivered. They look super pretty, but I want to show you something really interesting. She said each stem has their own, like, container with water in it. That's like some high quality. I didn't even know how high quality that was. That's wild. I hope you can, like, see in the picture. Like, can you guys see that? Isn't that wild? So, they definitely stayed super fresh. Um, but yeah, tomorrow's Valentine's Day. I don't think I have anything special going on until the nighttime. Alan and I are going to go on date night to this little Italian restaurant that we love. Um, we went there last year for Valentine's Day. It's like really small and romantic, so I'm excited about that. Um, I'm currently just marinating some chicken breast, and I have some potatoes on the oven, broccoli that I'm going to make. Just like an easy go-to dinner for Alan and myself. But that's probably it for today. See, I got home, brought me a really pretty bag of roses. Yay! Good morning. Happy Valentine's Day, my sweet friends. So, yeah, today is Wednesday, a.k.a. V-Day. Um, I just went ahead and did my makeup. We're looking a little bright here. Um, but I'm wearing this really beautiful shimmer on my lids. It's from the <clears throat> FabFitFun box yesterday. It's the Cover FX, the little shimmer veil in Amethyst is the color. Like, it's so pretty. Like, look how shimmery and purple it is. Um, I don't know, I just thought it was kind of pretty and romantic and I have some filming to do. What is this little hair doing? So, and I'm also wearing um, one of the KKW Beauty lip creams again. I like to mix a couple of the colors. I just like how it looks better. I'm still in my pajamas, but um, I'm just gonna make a little berry concoction like I do. Um, and I'm admiring my pretty roses. They're so pretty. Um, I love them. So, Alan's at work. When he gets back tonight, we're gonna go out. I think I mentioned this yesterday. We're going to this really um, cute little hole in the wall Italian place that we love. <clears throat> but yeah, I'm excited. So, I just have a lot of work to do today, a lot of filming, um, getting things done, working for the man. Oh, shit. Hey guys, so I'm just checking in. It's a little bit later now. Um, I've pretty much just been working all day. I actually went out and ran a couple errands, the usual. So I just got a little package in from Amazon. So I ordered a couple new products for when I start the Accutane journey. And I'm sorry, I keep, I feel like I keep talking about it, but it's such a big, like, part of my life right now, and it's such a big anticipation for me. So I know that my body gets really, really dry, where it will be when I'm on it. So um, Carly Humbert had recommended this Alba Botanical Very Emollient Maximum Body Lotion. I found it on Amazon. It's huge, and I guess it's for, like, severely dry skin. And then she also recommended the Mario Badescu Alpha Grapefruit Cleansing Lotion. It doesn't, like, dry your skin out. So, <laughs> I also bought something a little bit extra, and you can judge me. Oops, that's my life in a nutshell. So, <laughs> I was feeling a little bit extra, um, and I bought a tea organizer. It's crazy, but it was like 10 bucks on Amazon, and we have so much tea in here. I was like, let's just organize the damn tea. I just really wanna organize everything. Um, because I just feel like I'm getting maybe that spring cleaning vibe. I don't know. Maybe I'm just making excuses. Um, but I have been drinking a lot of the Yogi green tea blueberry. And I just bought this chai tea from Tazo. Um, the vanilla bean macaroon is delicious. And of course, the refresh mint tea. I love mint tea. So I got this little 
six compartment tea organizer. There's so many of these on Amazon. I'm like, for a good organization, what's $10? <laughs> oh, I only have a couple of these left. Um, so I just thought it would be fun to organize them. So let's organize tea. <laughs> oh, I have Alan's Valentine's gift ready to go. So let's see. Wow, I'm like getting low. I just think it looks so like nice and organized. I'm definitely ready for spring cleaning. Like the other day I got a bunch of um, like cleaning material for the car, like stuff to wipe it down, stuff to make it smell good. Yeah, this just looks so pretty. I'm a Capricorn, so y'all know I love some good organization. It just makes me feel alive. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, I just love it. I know. Some people right now are watching and they're like, this girl's crazy, but tell me that this does not satisfy your anal behavior like a fellow Capricorn. <laughs> so anyway, tea is organized. Also, I'm over here like a true New Englander opening the window when it's 45 degrees. Um, but I got home and it was like really stuffy in here. So I guess I can shut it now. You know, if you're like a New Englander, you live somewhere cold, the second it gets like <laughs> above 40, we're like, it's spring. It's not, it's not spring. Also, you guys remember yesterday I went to Target and they didn't have my lash glue or eye drops, so I went to a different Target. <laughs> and I got the Visine for contacts. This is the one I always use. If you have kind of dry eyes with your contacts. And then they were out of the original blue duo, but this one's kind of like got a little applicator. I've never tried this one, but I trust duo. Ooh, your girl is Valentine's Day date night ready. Um, well, I don't have like my outfit on yet, uh, <laughs> but we're going out in about an hour. I have literally just been working <laughs> it's just not exciting so there's not much to say just like filming and editing but anyway i flipped my hair into a side part because i feel like that's more romantic um it's very voluminous just kind of teased it a bit and um yeah i threw on for my lipstick my favorite red this is the fenty beauty uncensored stunna lip paint i had a hard time hard time i literally had to like <sighs> use a million q-tips and my concealer brush like it took me probably 20 minutes i don't know why i just had like a really hard time uh so yeah anyway um that's my look for valentine's day i don't know what i'm gonna wear yet but i always like to wear a red lip on valentine's day uh it was kind of funny i actually like took my eyeshadow off and just put on like <laughs> neutral eye and a wing and um this is like my classic valentine's day look cut my contour a bit can see my highlighter pop in and um yeah i guess i'll catch up with you guys probably tomorrow because i'm just gonna go on my date night tonight and i'm not gonna vlog that i need some alone time good morning friends so happy thursday the day after valentine's day so yeah i had a really nice time last night alan and i just had a really nice dinner some quality time um, I'll show you in a second. He got me a giant card. You guys have probably seen those giant cards at the store before, so it was kind of funny. I'm kind of sad though. I don't know what's wrong with these roses that he got me a few days ago. Like, I take such good care. I cut the bottoms, change the water. They, they looked perfect when he gave them to me. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I've never struggled so much with them, so I'm kind of sad. Let me know if you have any tips and tricks for roses and how to revitalize them. But, anywho, I'll show you my outfit in a second because I know you guys are curious. Actually, I mean, I can just tell you. I have on this Believe Women crop top from Prem. And then I have this really fun, like, teddy bear style, um, dusty pink, like, jacket on. It's so cute. And I'm sure it's cheap right now. It's on Rue21, their website. 
I'm kind of annoyed. <laughs> it's my own, I'm annoyed at myself. I bought a bunch of stuff from Rue 21 and I've just been wearing it and I never hauled it. Um, but I'll link this below for you guys. So, uh, what is this? What is this? I don't know if this is just PR. Oh, I wish I'd opened this yesterday. <laughs> oh man, I forgot to open, I didn't open this yesterday even though it was here. Um, I was just kind of working yesterday. Oh, so we have a little Valentine's Day Urban Decay PR package. This is so adorable. How do I open it? I don't want to ruin it. It's like a little chocolate kit. And it has the original Naked palette and some of their Vice lipsticks. Oh my goodness, this is so cute. Okay, that's adorable. Um, definitely will be saving some of those for my next giveaway and playing with some soon. This morning I filmed a full face of new makeup, like chit chat, get ready with me, on like all the new makeup that I hauled from Sephora and Ulta like last week. So the makeup came out really pretty. I like how this looks. So we'll see how it wears. Keep an eye out for that video soon. And I think these are my sandals that I ordered. I ordered myself um, a pair of nice slides for the summer. I hope they fit. I hope all is well. I ordered them with Ebates. Yeah, so I ordered them with Ebates and I ended up getting like a decent amount of cash back because they are pricey. <laughs> oh, I've never, I've never bought a pair of designer shoes before. But look at this gorgeous box. <laughs> so beautiful just the box is beautiful um, but I saw these being advertised and I just fell in love with them and I love slides I love them so much and Gucci has to be like one of my favorite brands like I just love everything Gucci uh, they're so beautiful I don't know why I was just so drawn to these I know they're not everyone's cup of tea but you know live your best life look how pretty these slides are with like the signature Gucci detailing and then like the flowers. I just think they're so pretty for summer. I hope they fit well. <laughs> My wide feet. Oh, they fit, thank God. <laughs> you know, I'm always worried because I got the wide feet. But they also come with um, <laughs> individual cases for each slide. But if you do your shopping right, and buy from like a Bloomingdale's or a Nordstrom, like somewhere that they have like coupon codes, do like a coupon code, go through Ebates so you'll get cash back. Like, you know, I just buy on this stuff full price. <laughs> so I always try to like find my little maneuvering to get a better deal, but they're so pretty. Oh, these are gonna be my gorgeous summer shoes um, all summer long. For the price, I'm gonna get the full wear out of them. Uh, so, it's actually really kind of warm out today. It's like 50, 55, so maybe I should wear them today. Oh, they're so cute. Look how adorable. I would size up on these though. I ended up getting the conversion of a US 11, and I normally wear a 10, and they like just fit. So definitely size up if you decide. I'll link these below as well. And so I'm just wearing my high-waisted joggers from Boohoo. My top again from Prem, and I just love this fuzzy cardigan. Isn't it cute? So I think I'm just gonna wear this, kind of counterbalance the summer shoes and warm top. Oh, I'm obsessed. I haven't even told you guys what I'm doing today. Um, so ugh. I want to work on my vision board today. Um, it's actually 12.20 right now, so I've been up for a few hours filming this makeup look and starting to edit it, answering some emails. Um, but I'm gonna run to Target and pick up stuff to make my vision board, so we're gonna do that today. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I'm excited. I'm saving it for the vlog fam, too. I'm not gonna do like a separate video. I'm just gonna include it here in the vlog, so we're gonna make our vision board, and I also have a winner for this purse giveaway from my Instagram, so I'm gonna mail that out to her. And uh, yeah, let's get going. Got my Diet Coke. You may judge me if you are that miserable. But also, this is still happening. <laughs> Can you see <laughs> how broken my windshield wiper is? It's like 
completely coming apart. Um, so I'm gonna get a new one tomorrow, and I also have to go to the car place. That didn't work, putting my seatbelt on that way. Uh, I also have to go to the car place tomorrow for um, something else. I keep filling up my tires, like, over the last few months, and there's still that little tire pressure light thing keeps coming on. It's like not that cold. Like I know that can happen. It can come on when it's cold, but it's you know almost 50 today. So anyway, I'm happy camper. Back again. The place we always go. Also, I ended up putting sneakers on because I'm over here thinking it's like freaking summer and it's still kind of cold. Day after Valentine's, <laughs> Easter, St. Patrick's Day. Oh my god, guys, this is the hat, super similar to the one I showed in my Florida vlog. It's $5 in this front section at Target. Guys, look how cute this one is. Oh my god, yes, Target. But if you want one similar to the one I wore in Florida, five bucks, Target. They also have a lot of really cute stuff to decorate your office space. Like, look how cute. No dreams, just goals, and it's all holographic. So... If you want to spice up your office, they have a lot of cute stuff. Fine apple and one in a melon. Cute. Even this little set here. Okay, still pondering like the crazy Target obsessed girl I am. Kind of love this. I just love all this like star action lately that we've been seeing. Why am I in the accessory section? I don't know. Should I be here? No. Not at all. Look how cute this hat is. Velvet with a moon. Alexis, you need this. Oh my god. This is so chic. Like, look how cool that is. It's like silk. Sequins. I love all these. Ooh. This rose gold detailing. Yes. little Easter color action. <laughs> Easter falls on April 1st this year. My mom's birthday, April Fool's. Seriously. I need none of this and I probably won't buy it, but I love a new day. They're this like new brand at Target. I've showed them before, but look how cool these hoops are. Like a double layer. They have so much cute stuff. I love like a cool hoop. Like look at these, these are like a double hoop. I love that. Another way Khloe Kardashian and I are the same. We love big hoops. Yes. Sugar Fix is here by Bobble Bar too. Oh, everything is so cute. I'm like so ready for spring. It's pretty. Don't worry, I'm not gonna buy one, but look at all of this. This is all their like new agendas and planners. It's so gorgeous. Even this for the wall. Look how pretty. I'm dying inside. I love all of this, the pink and the gray. So cute. I'm dying, I want all of this. Okay, I'm in the arts and crafts aisle. I don't know how big I want my vision board to be. Like this, there's a bigger one, but I think I wanna start small. There's three in here, I only need one. But I like the idea of the foam, it's a little bit thicker, more sturdy. I don't really know what else I need. I saw Mallory Irvine Irvin did one with like pins. So I kind of like that idea so you don't have to like glue, get messy, but I don't know. Mod Podge, I've always seen this in like YouTube videos. Ooh, I think we need glitter glue. Okay, so I got my vision board. So I found this is like some spray adhesive. It's like new. And it has a poster board on it, so I thought it would be good. I grabbed scissors, because I only have really small ones, and look how cute these are with the marble and the pink. So I thought I could always spray and then do some glitter in certain areas too. And then the push pins. Now I need to figure out which magazines. I have a feeling I'm gonna want <laughs> a lot of home decor. Maybe one of these for like style. Ooh, maybe wedding. <laughs> Ooh, gorgeous. Yes, Serena. I think I'll probably want to do some wedding stuff. 
I don't know. Gotta decide which one has the best pictures. <laughs> All right, guys, I am home now and I'm cracking up. I literally just got a Valentine's Day card from my mom and it is so funny. So it's for me and Alan. <laughs> it's <laughs> little salt shakers. This is Alexandra Allen babies. <laughs> Oh, someone's ready to be a grandma. Not yet, mom. Okay, so I also got sent this from First Aid Beauty, and I'm actually really excited about this, um, again, for when I'm on Accutane. So this is the Ultra Repair Tinted Moisturizer. It has SPF. It's like a natural luminous finish, which will be great when my skin is dry. Um, and First Aid Beauty, I really like their stuff. I've bought a lot of their products. Uh, so... Lasting coverage that won't flake on you. So that sounds really good for when my skin gets dry So clinically shown to do 12 hours of hydration giving your skin the tender loving coverage that won't flake off So this is actually perfect 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 for um, The future it has like oatmeal hyaluronic acid vitamin E micro pearls a bunch of stuff for um, hydrating the skin so when I'm getting dry on my medication, we will try this out. And okay, so this is what I got for my vision board. So I ended up getting this size spray adhesive. These adorable scissors, because I'm a sucker for cute packaging. All this loose glitter, like look at that. I wanna put it on my eyeballs. Uh, and I got the clear push pins. And I only got three magazines because, I mean, they're huge. I just got the Marie Claire. I got L. These are, like, both really thick. And then I got the Knot. I'm not engaged, guys, but <laughs> um, I figure this will have some really beautiful stuff in it and great pictures as well. Um, and I actually, the first page that I had opened this up to had a plus-size model in a wedding dress, and I immediately was drawn to it. So, you know, eventually we'll need this. Eventually. So I'm sitting on my floor. I have my vision board in front of me. I'm also watching vlogs. <laughs> but I'm going to essentially just go through. Oh my God, I took my bra off. <laughs> That's awkward. If you don't take your bra off when you get home, I don't get you. So yeah, I'm just going to go through these magazines and just start to cut things out that are inspiring or um, that feel fitting to what I've been feeling. And I think also I'm going to go ahead and attempt some of this spray adhesive with the glitter and just kind of do like certain areas on here just so like the background has a little pop as well. Uh, I also, I wish, I hope I can find maybe like the word vision in here or cut out like, you know, the spelling of vision. Um, but I don't know. I'm just going to kind of take it a step at a time and see what I can find in here. Okay, this is no joke. <laughs> I have been here for two hours <laughs> and it's a lot of work. I'm actually, I'm having a lot of fun though. Like I've just been <laughs> putting on a YouTube playlist and just working on this. Um, but essentially I have cut out a lot of travel pictures and just like a lot of like powerful words. I also put like some wedding inspo on here for the future. But in all actuality, I think I'm going to be here for a while. Good morning, everybody. Happy Friday. We made it through the week. I hope you guys had a good week and you're enjoying relaxing and watching this. So um, it's morning. I'm doing a peel off mask, which I'm pretty excited about. Um, so this is the Soap and Glory What a Peeling, like what a feeling, what a peeling um, <laughs> purifying declog mask. So it looks like this. And it came in like little tubs. I think they were for two times, but I needed both and um, a spatula. So I've had it on for about 25 minutes. It's really cute because it's like pink and fun, but I thought if you like to watch people peel off masks, maybe you'll want to watch this. Ooh, okay, it's so satisfying. Why is it so satisfying? Maybe I should wait a little longer. Some of it still feels like a tiny bit wet, but Oh, couldn't resist. Uh, but it said 20 to 25 minutes and it's been like the full 25 minutes. Ooh, why is it so much fun to peel off a mask? Oh my gosh. This is really good for declogging your pores, getting all the gunk out. I feel like the cheeks always take the longest. 
<laughs> like there's always a little bit more time needed on the cheeks and like in the center of the face. Isn't that weird? There's gotta be some logical explanation. All right. Anyway, I'm gonna let this dry a little, I'll take the rest off and get ready. I'm going to a car appointment. I have to go and I told you guys yesterday I'm having a couple issues so I'll go to the car place. Then I'm gonna meet up with Gabby for lunch because I haven't seen her in like two weeks um, since before I left for Florida. So we're gonna grab some lunch and catch up. So see you soon. Wow, it is warm. And also I can tell my car is not adjusted because Alan <laughs> drove it last. <laughs> So tall, so tall. Um, hello, I'm ready. My face is done. I cannot stop wearing the KKW Beauty Lip Creams. I just love them. I also switched back to my um, Gucci Soho Disco today. I don't know, I missed this little bag. She reminds me of spring and it's 50 degrees again, so pretty exciting. All right, I'm off to the car place. Gabby and I are exploring Whole Foods and we're eating cheese samples. Here. Thank you, fam. This is champagne cheddar. Ooh. Way better than that. I like that one. Well, I'm tempted to buy it right now. That's why it's $12.99 a pound. No, it's on sale. For $12.99. Oh like, it's, like it's normally $20 a pound. That's delicious. It's only $4. I mean, it's, it's very small, but still. It's amazing. That's the best cheese I've ever had in yeah, my life. Yeah, 100% um, what I recommend to everyone who needs it. Kind of fig spread, guys. If you need a good cheese board, they even sell cheese board. Whole Foods got you covered. There's more of it. Yeah, there oh, this is, oh, that's not pasta, but it's like done. So, like, how much is it for this? Well, you should get it then. How much is it? That's the there's date, no, I think. Yeah, I was like, there's no way it's $2.25. Um, oh wait, is it under that little sign? Oh, $8.99 here, $5.99, so it's probably in this range. It's not that bad. It's I mean, not it the worst. Bad. I mean, yeah. I think I'm gonna hold off for today, but definitely, oh. Potato, cheddar, and jalapeno. I also, I'm gonna have this tonight, and Brussels sprouts, and look at all these fresh peonies. Oh my God. Um. Oh, this is your whole world. <laughs> Hi, I'm Gabby, and I love olive bars. There's another one over there. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> I love olives. Chipotle. Chorizo flavored queso. Stop. <laughs> Wait, but like, ooh, jalapeno queso. Okay, oh. But what is um clumage? I think that's the brand. Oh, no, what? it's not. Maybe it means creamy. Wait, because creamy fresh cheese, clumage chipotle. Clumage. All I know is this sounds amazing. <laughs> Sounds very sexual. Oh, my phone. Oh. So serious. You were so serious. So Gabby and I are up here looking at all the cheese, maple, truffle, champagne cheddar, and then, hello, <laughs> golden monkey. What? Now, what do you, I want a serious opinion from all of you. What do you think golden monkey cheddar is going Should to Should we read like? the label? Yeah, I, you I, know what? Hold on. I have questions. I do too. Hold on. Key, no, hold on. It's from Pennsylvania. Cheddar cheese, and then cream cheese. Okay. It just has a bunch of, uh, oh, there's beer in it. Oh, maybe that's why? Maybe Probably. maybe it's a kind of beer? Yeah. But I was really, is there port wine? No, Guys, we, we are in we cheese love. heaven. We're cheese and olive. I'm kind of regretting not buying that champagne cheddar. Truffled Asiago dip, I'm sorry. That's Stop <laughs> it. I that. need all of this. Wait, what is this? So Gabby and I are out to lunch, and we decided to try buffalo cauliflower. We've always wanted to try it. It is so, so good. It's amazing. Our new obsession. Okay. Alright guys, so it's a little bit later now. I am alone. I'm gonna go and get my nails done. My acrylics have grown out quite a bit. And I think it's time to take the acrylics off. I have reached that point. I'm satisfied. Uh, I'm gonna take them off and just go back to like my natural nails and get my gel. I was really loving like the length of the acrylics. They look a little bit more fancy, but... I go through phases. I always have acrylics for like a couple months and then I just stop. So uh, I'm gonna go, my hair's gotten pretty long, huh? Actually, yeah, I guess it's, would you consider this still short or like medium? Probably medium, I guess. Weird, I don't know. It still feels short to me it's just because I had extensions before, but I guess it's fairly long. Um, all right, 
nail time. All right, guys, I just got home. Nails are done. So I ended up going back. I This is exactly what I do every time. It's like with my hair. Grow it out and cut it. Grow it out and cut it. So with my nails, sometimes I'll, like probably once a year, I get acrylics for a couple months. It happens to me. I don't, I don't know. I go back and forth. Um, but I ended up taking off the acrylics. I was there for literally almost two hours. I'm actually kind of tired. I don't know why. I, you know when it's just like draining to just like sit there and wait? And she had me, I've never had them do this before. She had me soak my hands in like a bowl of hot like heated underneath um acetone and it made my hands so dry like the tips of my fingers just feel like sandpaper and she like oiled them and stuff but I, I was there for a really long time and it was kind of unpleasant and like my fingers don't look great like they look kind of dry and like they're kind of flaking like i don't know I, i'm not gonna lie i've never had that person do it before um and i just didn't didn't really love the situation, but they do look really pretty. Um, so she took the acrylics off and we did the dip powder because it makes your nails nice and hard and like has vitamins in it. And my nails were really, really fragile from having acrylics for a few months. So the color looks really pretty. Unfortunately, I don't know the name of it because they just have like um, the colors on, you know, like those fake nails so you can pick out a color. So I don't know what color it was. Um, so alan and i are texting because we realize there's going to be a snowstorm tomorrow night um but it doesn't show it on my weather app which is kind of weird like but it's everyone's talking about like the snowstorm like the car place is talking about the snowstorm everyone's talking about the snowstorm but, like <laughs> doesn't say it anywhere else um but anyway nails are done back to my original i always get like a pale whitish pink milky color um and then every once in a while i get my splash of red <laughs> that's it like i'm so basic um i just i like my routine also i forgot to show you guys these little baby hoops i don't know if you can see them on camera but do you see these little baby rose gold hoops on my ears I really love them. I got them off of Amazon, and they're like kind of a cool replacement for studs, and I just keep them always in my ear. Uh, if I remember, I'll link them below. If not, tweet me and remind me. Comes home and immediately lights candles. <laughs> uh, these peonies look gorgeous. Look how beautiful. Oh my goodness. It's so nice to have fresh like spring flowers in the house. These smell incredible. This is probably gonna be like a very rare situation because these were so expensive and I don't think I've ever spent that much on flowers. Um, but I want to do a little treat yourself moment and I can put them in the background for filming. Got something from Amazon Prime. Guys, I just love how cute these scissors are. All right, what did I order now? I don't remember. Oh my God. So little I got these little um gold studs for my second holes in my ears because I never wear earrings very rarely I'm gonna go watch Riverdale I haven't even talked about that yet I have been I'm so lazy right now um, it's almost five o'clock like it's been a weird weird day and I forgot to pick up toilet paper so that's fantastic um, <laughs> uh, I started watching Riverdale, I think three days ago. I'm almost done with season one. I'm obsessed, loving it so much. I'm probably going to finish season one like today. Um, and I'm so in love with it. I just, I can't believe it took me this long to hop on the board. Like it's such a classic show that I would love and I just resisted it for too long. <laughs> I'm like, fine, I'll try it. So I need to figure out where I'm gonna watch season two. I think I can watch it on the CW or something. I don't know, I'll figure it out, but I love Riverdale. Good morning guys, happy Saturday. So I came on to end the vlog, the vlog. I am headed out to the gym, wearing my usual everyday gym attire. Um, so I actually woke up and my nose is really stuffy, so I'm really hoping I didn't get sick because yesterday I was with Gabby and she, um has this cold like the runny nose stuffy nose situation so i really hope i didn't get it but ever since i woke up like an hour ago it's just been like non-stop so i'm really just gonna go sweat it out at the gym and maybe get like a green smoothie after or something to just hopefully vanish this away 
Um, but anyway, I'm off to the gym. I'm going to end the vlog here because when I come home, I'm going to edit it so it can go up tomorrow for you guys. But I love you so much. Thank you for watching this weekly vlog. I'm glad you've been loving it, and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.